Franken Tune Franken Tune Studio Hello and welcome. This is Enrique from Franken Tune Studio. And today we're diving into this quick start guide for Twiggleland, our new vector assets pack for Affinity Designer. If you've used any of our other vector kits, you'll feel right at home. Twiggleland works exactly the same. Just drag and drop elements onto your artboard and start building scenes right away. Let's install the assets. Open the Assets panel in Affinity Designer, choose Import Assets, then browse for the two files, Trigolon A AF Assets, Trigolon B dot AF Assets. Import them one by one, and boom! You now have the full collection ready to go. These shapes are organized by categories like bushes and shrubs, springs and stems, leaves, rocks and boulders, desert, tropical, and more. So you can find what you need fast. They are designed to help you quickly build background scenes for your characters or comics, especially when you don't have time to design nature settings from scratch. These are your ready-made building blocks. And they are super flexible. You can recolor them, resize and move them around, ungroup them if you want to tweak the path manually, or just leave them as is. Honestly, you probably won't even need to edit them. Trigoland also comes with two color palettes. One of them is called Mystery Forest. It's packed with slightly offbeat tones that add a moody, dramatic feel to your scenes. You can spend hours experimenting. It's genuinely fun. Like creative playtime. No pressure. Just drag shapes around and start building something cool. With over 200 assets, the combo possibilities are endless. Start with primitive tree shapes or abstract foliage, layer them up and bring your world to life. Just keep in mind, these tools are meant to support your creativity, not replace it. You're still the one in control. This is your scene, your story. Trigoland just makes it easier and a lot faster to get going. And in the next part, I'll show you how to add texture and depth using some bonus brushes included in the pack. One of the things I love about Trigoland is that it's not just about shapes. It gives you everything you need to create full, illustrated backgrounds. Clean vector shapes optional coral palettes, and even stippling texture brushes for depth and atmosphere. The included brushes are taken straight from our Spectral Grains pack. Just a simplified set of three raster brushes optimized for quick texturing. But don't worry, they're still incredibly useful on their own. Let me walk you through how I usually texture my scenes. Well, first, select all your vector elements and ungroup them. Now, you can freely add texture within individual shapes, either the quick way or the manual way. Let's cover both. The quick method. Select the vector shape and use the brush tool. Affinity will automatically create a clipping mask, so you can paint inside the shape without setting anything up manually. Create a new pixel layer, rename it something like Tree Texture, drag that pixel layer inside the vector shape layer, 
and that's your clipping mask. Now, just grab one of the included texture brushes and start painting. The brushes are pressure sensitive, so you can control how soft or bold your textures appear. Use darker or lighter shades from the existing color palette to keep things consistent. You don't need a complex lighting setup. If you're a beginner, stick to a top-down light source. That means highlights go on top and shadows go on the bottom. That's it. No need to overthink lighting. Just pick a direction and go. You'll be amazed at how quickly your flat shapes start to feel more dimensional. Okay, let's keep going. I'm going to texture a few more shapes now. I'll pick a hill, select soft green, and brush some lighter strokes near the top. This gives the effect of sunlight hitting it. Maybe add a reddish patch to suggest a bed of flowers or distant foliage. Little touches like that bring life to your scene. Now let's move to this bush. Add some dark shading at the base and it suddenly feels grounded. You see how easy this is? With just a few brush strokes, you can create the illusion of depth, light and texture without needing to be a pro. And if you want to take it one step further, try adding hand-drawn details on top. Just create a new pixel layer and use this monaural ink brush to add some lines, spots, or stray leads. These human touches really elevate the scene. You're blending vector structure with organic texture, and it's a beautiful combo. The real beauty of Twiggleland is its flexibility. You can go super minimal or fully detailed. Use it as a warm-up tool or to build full illustrations. Stick to the basic kit or mix in the full spectral grains pack for more options. There's no pressure, no wrong way to use it. Just creativity made simple. And the best part, it's actually fun. Seriously, some days, I catch myself just zoning out, dragging shapes around, adding a little texture here and there, and suddenly, I've made something that looks fully illustrated. So go ahead, fire up Affinity Designer, load the assets, put on some music, and let your imagination do the rest. Twiggleland is just the beginning. You can easily combine it with our other vector packs, like the Botanical Vector Series for Affinity, to build even richer scenes and more diverse environments. And if you enjoy adding texture, try mixing in more brushes from our other collections too. The possibilities are endless. You've got a powerful illustration studio right at your fingertips. And we are here to make sure you have the right tools to get the most out of it. Whether you're just starting out or you're a seasoned pro, Twiggleland is built for all skill levels. We always strive to create tools that are not only useful but genuinely fun to use. Because fun is one of the most important ingredients in any creative process. Thanks for watching and happy creating! Franken two Franken two Franken two Franken two Franken two Franken two